All right, guys, so now we are going to do a tutorial video on how to connect our Inboxer to Zapier. Zapier is one of the world's coolest tools ever that in this case, we're gonna use it to get the user's email and add them to our autoresponders and whatnot. But uh, we, we can connect to thousands and thousands of different apps and do some really cool things. Now, we're gonna choose our fan page here. We're gonna go to page manager, then page settings here. We're then gonna click on the integration tab up the top. Now here, we are gonna go generate keys. This is gonna grab us a few different keys here. Now what we're gonna to wanna to do now is go over to Zapier, zapier.com. If you haven't signed up before, I'm gonna show you how to do it from scratch. We're gonna log in. Create an account. It's really simple to set this up once and once it's set up once, that's all you need to do. Um, company name, Inboxer, I'm going to call it. Whatever yours is, write it. CEO, I don't know. Um, marketing, IT developer, whatever. Now, we want to search for the app Inboxer. Actually, we'll finish this setup quickly for now. And I am back again because what I found is that my developer has our little zap on private. So uh, essentially you'll have a link back here now, which I'm getting added here, which will say join on Zapier, which will invite you privately to be a part of this zap. So I'm going to accept this invite and build this zap. Um, otherwise, I'm going to make it after we uh, get a handful of people um, on this uh, new zap here, we will make it public for everyone that they can just search for the zap here. So we're gonna add a name for this zap itself. I'm gonna call this zap uh, Inboxer. So it's gonna be an email trigger here that um, triggers when user shares his or her email with the bot. We can then sync that email across over to our autoresponders or whatever we wanna sync that email to, which is pretty damn cool. So we're gonna save and continue this now. We're gonna connect an account. Now these are the three areas that we wanted to connect from over here inside of Inboxer. So I'm gonna copy this one, head it back over here. I'm gonna copy the second one, paste it here. And now I'm gonna copy the third one, the page ID and paste that there. And yes, and continue. Now, if I head back over to here, where are we, edit zap. That has been connected. We can test it if we want to. For now, I'm just gonna save and continue. Uh, I'm gonna skip this step, but you can go ahead and um, pull examples if you want. I'm gonna continue without examples. Um, and there we go, continue with default sample. Now we have created the zap and now we wanna add in an action step that I missed. Now I wanna connect this with Aweber. That's what I use. I can connect it with MailChimp, I can connect it with um, any form of autoresponder that's inside of Zapier, which is thousands of them. Um, I'm gonna create a new subscriber whenever that happens inside of there. It'll probably ask me to log into my Aweber here. Um, connect it, I'm gonna pause this and connect. So I've gone ahead and added in my Aweber here. I'm gonna save and continue that there. Now again, I'll set up my actual details here. I can select the list that, that I want it to actually go to. Um, I can go ahead and select all that information here in a second, but again, uh, I'm not gonna go into too much detail with Aweber because a lot of you guys won't be using Aweber. Um, but you can actually go and learn how to set up your autoresponder here itself. Then once you've done that, uh, it'll continue, it'll connect to your inboxer. So whenever the emails come in to your messaging tab, they will be added automatically to the specific list that you have chosen from that specific fan page. Absolutely killer. We're gonna go into more details of that inside of the VIP training and on webinars as well. Um, but essentially, this is what I wanted to show you guys how to connect Inboxer to Zapier itself. Um, and then Zapier itself has a bunch of tutorials if you need to connect it to other apps that um, aren't belonging to Inboxer. 
All right, guys, see you in the next video.